Hello everyone! Welcome back! It is XCOM Enemy Unknown with Lucky and... Goofy! Good to see you all, everyone. Alright. Well, figuratively speaking. Figuratively speaking, <laughs> yes, yes. Let's get started on our mission. We downed an alien saucer here after our poor little intercept ship barely survived the encounter. And we uh, are trying to go after it see what we can find in the wreckage. We're going to send our scouts up front, making sure they're in cover. We don't have a contact yet, which is pretty strange considering how close we're getting to the enemy vessel. Mm. Don't we need to arc for one of those crystal thingies? Y yes, we do, if that's yeah. possible. I remember we tried before twice and it didn't work. Hmm. Hmm. Makes me wonder what just what happened, what went wrong. There we are. Everyone has moved up. But we don't hear where it's coming from. Suspicious. Well, maybe he'll see something now. Alright, he hasn't, so let's just put our heavy gunner on overwatch. While we have our medic move up and see what's over in this direction. Nothing! Well then he can have two fields of cover there. Hmm. Alright, our sniper should stay in the back, so let's just say she'll be over here. Okay, Hernandez! Let's see, did we give him a nickname yet? No, most of them don't have nicknames, or they have like computer assigned ones which suck. Like Arcade, come on. Yeah. Not that good. That one's pretty lame, I agree. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at the side of the ship. It's like maybe this really strange smoke. Doesn't look like normal mm. fire smoke. Eh, but whatever, whatever. Alright, so another one of our medics, I guess, will move up here. It's very odd that they're letting us get this close to the wreckage. They must be in a much worse situation than previously thought. Mm. Here's Badass, though. It's time for him to run forward with his scatter laser. Woo! He even gets the cutscene. Oh, yeah. Of course he does. Oh, we got noise coming from that direction. Ah, Thin Man. One of them's on top of the vessel. Which means he has high ground. Well, I think he just... Reaction shot! Nice! Well, he picked the wrong spot to come out of. Alright, let's see if our sniper can shoot them. No. Alright, what about our medic? Does he have a good shot? Yeah, not bad. Pretty good, actually. Let's try it with our new laser gun. Two damage. Okay. That works. Oh, I hit him. Alright, sniper girl, can you actually run up to this cover and take a shot? Yes, you can. 75%. <laughs> That's pretty good. Laser rifle, go! Six damage. Alright, I'll start cutting her some slack. Apparently yeah. all she needed was lasers. Yep, Nishimura, in true Japanese fashion, just needed some high-tech lasers <laughs> from a sci-fi anime in order to make it all possible. I think she needs an anime nickname. Really? Like what? I don't know. We've been watching a lot of girls in Panzer. Maybe we should, uh... What, do you want to call her Miho? Yeah, maybe. Or Nishizumi? Nah, I don't like new shizumis. Okay. We'll figure it out. Something suitably Japanese. You could just call it Panzer. Mm, <laughs> Panzer. <laughs> That's one Panzer. Yeah. I don't know if you guys have seen it. Definitely give it a shout out. Love it. Yeah, it's a funny anime show. Relatively recent. There are not many uh, animes that I've seen that are that recent that I like that much. And I'm not really a big anime watcher either. I just watch a very select few. Movies. Typically older stuff from the 80s and 90s. Anyway, lots of mutons and rocket things. Oh, I forget what they're called. Jerks. That's what they're called. <laughs> Alright, um, he can actually open this door, I think. Yes, he can. And that enables him to fire his rockets Ooh. at these two guys. And this will also shred them, which means they'll take more damage from the rest of the people. 
Take this, pal. Yippee! Oh my gosh, it also blew up one of the <laughs> rocketeers <laughs> and it also oh, shattered the wall of the place. Wow. Okay. Floater, that's what they're called. Floater, yes. Okay, that's their name. Alright, well our medics, I guess they're all set up in order to start their assault. I guess we could have him... We don't want to bunch the guys up because these guys can throw grenades at us. Yeah. Oh, actually our runner and gunner has a shot at quite a few people here. But none of the none of the shots are actually that good. So I'm going to have him move over here. And then try... ...computer could prove to be extremely useful in our own research. Please take great care in returning it to the base okay. in one piece. Okay, don't blow up the flight computer. Gotcha. Which one's the flight computer? The big shiny one. Okay, not the one that you just blew up. No. Alright, we've got rapid fire, so he can take two shots at one of these targets. 52. 56 is actually our best percentage. Let's okay. use that one. Go, badass! Go! Oh, shoot again! What? He never misses. Alright, there we go. There we go. He redeemed himself. He's happy now. He got, he, he got He's him. He's my favorite! He did what had to be done. Alright, we have another medic who has a uh, okay shot at both of these guys, so give it a rip. Oh, nope. He missed. Mm. Sorry, Ricardo. It was kind of through a shiny door. It was through it's a probably not that easy. Nishimura should not get too close to him because she... They might throw a grenade, so we'll actually have her go last. Alright, we have another guy here, but he only has an assault rifle, which is kind of a problem. Uh, can we... Will he have cover if he goes over there? No, he won't. This guy actually has a flank shot on both of them. Wait, we haven't captured a, mut a Muton yet, have we? No. Oh, but that's the thing. They're both pretty healthy. Let's see if we can actually hit him once critically once. damage one. That one we have a more likely chance to hit. Okay, we got one out of the way. All right, maybe you should arc through the other one before it dies. I think 17! I think they need to be at three health, though, before that'll work. Oh, okay. Um, can so he... So, you need somebody who's not going to hit it that hard. Hmm. This Maybe guy... Maybe guy is the, with the assault he... rifle, because he won't do as much damage. Alright, I'll try it. Yeah. He's kind of exposed here, but hopefully he'll be alright. Alright, give it your best shot, buddy. Whoop, I, I didn't mean to do that. See Two damage! Alright, he's weakened now. Yeah. Nishimura, um... Hmm. Maybe she can run over this way. And then throw her battle scanner into the middle of the ship. Uh, I want to make it go as far as possible. Uh, that might actually reveal enemies on the opposite side of that wall, so let's try that. Yeah. Uh, no, nothing else is revealed. Oh, that guy. Okay, well this floater, I don't know what he's doing. He's chilling out. Yutan is apparently complaining. Hmm. Oh, okay, he fires at uh, that guy. Oh, he's badly hurt. Yeah, but Cri you have a medic right next to him. Critical hit. Let's hope the Mutant doesn't shoot him. Oh, hey, he's gonna shoot him. Oh, but he misses! Okay. I'm alright! Wow, that was a close call there, bud. Yeah. Alright, this calls for badass! No, arc thrower! No, which one has the arc thrower? Not badass one. Badass doesn't have it this time? Oh, yeah, this guy does. Yeah. Can he actually get close enough to use it, though? I don't know if you can run and gun and use the stun feature at the same time. I don't, know. I don't think you can. So we're going to have to... Ah, I got an idea. We're going to have Badass here do run and gun. He's going to get rid of the floater. Yeah. In true Badass fashion. Go, Badass, go! I'm just going to run right past you, dude. Ooh. He's that kind of guy. Uh-oh. He'll be alright. He badassed himself into a bad situation. Uh, he'll make it work. Alright, and then he's gonna shoot... No, not him. This one. In the face! Hello! Ooh. One yeah. damage! <laughs> one damage! Fantastic! Come on, badass! Cut me some slack here, buddy. Oh! Oh, that's painful. Alright, um... <laughs> crap. What the hell are we gonna do? All right, this guy should get in cover before he like gets shot. Yeah. Horribly, and he can heal, heal his himself. wounds. I'm gonna spray randomly at the wall, and it'll fix it. It'll bounce back. 
and make me feel better. All right, we're going to have our heavy gunner run around the corner because we saw there was a contact over this way that we were worried about. Oh, he's actually really close to the flight computer. That's that's not very good, actually. Um, Do we have cover over here? No. Uh, crap. Uh, well, let's make sure that Badass isn't by himself. Go help Badass. Wait, wasn't he the one with the stun gun? No. Okay. Um, here! Oh, I've got an idea. Huh? We can throw a smoke grenade in here, and then the other guy that has the stun baton can run up and try to zap him with it on the next turn. So I think the smoke lasts for one turn as well. Ishimura, you're just gonna chill out. This isn't really a thing for snipers. Alright, so let's uh, have him try to run up and get behind something. Does this go... No, that doesn't give him cover, does it? That doesn't really either. Ah, uh, whatever. Well, just run up... In the smoke. Just run to the corner, get in the smoke, and maybe you can do something productive here. Wait, he can't chop them? Oh, wait. Can Nishimura pick off that one in the corner? She might be able to. Go, Nishimura! No, or just blow up the wall. Alright, well, we're gonna get shot at, but luckily these guys have armor. Yeah. <laughs> Badass <laughs> dodges at <laughs> short range! He's like, whoa! Nope! <laughs> Oh, and even heavy dude, man. Oh, no, badass missed. They missed him again. <laughs> they just can't shoot this guy. Oh, uh, because he's too badass to get shot? Apparently. But isn't it also badass to get shot like that and not be a, like that bothered by it? He's like, yeah, I'm okay. I'm fine. <laughs> it happens. It's, it's a flash wound. It's, it's not a big deal. It happens a lot, actually. Hi, good night. Um, you want to you wanna try that again there, pal? Somebody maybe want to do more than one damage? He needs a bigger gun. Okay. Yeah, well, you, you did what you had to do. Alright, this guy now. He's close enough to sneak up on this Mewtown and give him the Zappy Whap. Mm -hmm. Hi there, Mewtown. How about a little bit of Zappy? Hope this works. We got him. Ooh. Now we want to try to get that crystal thingy, whatever it is. Yeah. I forget what they call it, though. Uh, crystalloid or something? Crystalloid? Well, that sounds reasonable. Alright, let's have... Uh, oh, wait, is that the flight computer back there? I don't know. Okay. Alright, Badass is going to hunker down for a sec. We're going to have everyone else run in here and get ready to try to distract that crystalloid. Maybe we can damage it and capture it with the stun gun. That's what we're hoping to do, anyway. All right, let's have Nishimura move over here in the corner. All right, alien activity, but we didn't see him. There's no visual. All right, well, he's out of ammo, so he should just reload. All right, this is one of our scouts, and he has a smoke grenade, so let's have him run in here. Reaction shot! Uh-oh. Dodge! Oh, nice. All right, just barely missed him. Okay, now, question is, hmm, well, actually, he's t I'm just going to have him hunker down for the time being. Nishimura, did not want to reload or something. Hmm. Uh, this guy, Hernandez, you wait over, yeah, you go over here and actually take cover on this direction. It looks like he only has three health, so it might actually be possible just to run up and zap him. The only problem is is that he's just not close enough to do it. Mm. So we're going to have him hunker down, too. Badass, you can chill, because you're just going to kill everything if you aren't out there. <laughs> and we don't want to kill it, at least not right away. Yeah, I hear the guy right behind me. All right, uh, big mighty man, he's going to run over here and try to draw its attention. Okay, that does not seem to have drawn its attention. Oh, wow, it actually backed up. Alright, which one of you actually has the zappy? You do. You could run up and do it right now. Alright, try to zap him. He's got three hit points. Got him! He captured the outsider. Alright. 
All right, Silent Giant. Woo! Com High five. Complete success. Only got a few injuries. Yeah, they'll be okay. Badass just needed to collect some more scars. Yeah, he, he's fine. Mm hmm A couple days. Yep. We get his now. He'll be fine. Just a flesh wound. Exactly. Back to Brazil. All right, lots of promotions all around. Our uh, Korean uh, squaddy has been promoted to corporal. Yeah, he's also in the hospital for two weeks. Uh, I want him to be able to move more quickly. That's always good. All right, our sergeants have become lieutenants. Okay, we either give him heat ammo. Whoa, whoops. We either give him heat ammo, which makes him do double damage against robots, mm. or rapid reaction, which gives him a second reaction shot if he's on Overwatch and the first one hits. Do you often put him on Overwatch? That's what these guys usually do. Okay. Alright, we'll give him rapid reaction. So now he can get double over uh, Overwatch shots if the first one hits. Always get revived for your medics. Because even though it's like, oh, they can suppress enemies. This means that if a guy goes down and he's critical, not only does it stabilize him, it'll actually bring him back to conscious again. Oh, nice. So, revive is much handier, right, in my opinion. Your men certainly seem to have a knack for capturing alien subjects alive. I only hope they realize how important their work is in relation to ours. Please, pass on my gratitude to our forces. Well, why don't you do it, Dr. Valen? <laughs> we got all kinds of resources. Which is good, because now we can do some investigating down at the research station. Alright, let's do some muton interrogation. Right. This captive is very aggressive, clearly having been intended to serve in a frontline combat role with the appropriate drug therapy and encouragement. <laughs> hmm. We may be able to coax some useful intel on the alien weaponry and their tactics. How do they communicate with these things? This is my question. I don't think they do. I think they just poke it with lasers. See, he whacked it. Uh-oh. Okay. That's hmm. better. Okay, plasma weaponry. Research credit earned. We learned a great deal from the captain about the alien weapon team. Weaponry, particularly their advanced plasma-based armaments. Okay, that's good. Alright, and we were working on heavy lasers. What about the crystal thing? Illyrium, plasma pistols, and new firecraft takes a long time. We can have heavy lasers, and then maybe we can work on the Illyrium after that. Alright. Alright, so let's continue our heavy lasers research so our heavies can have laser machine guns. And uh, as for engineering, well, we don't have any money, so that kind of doesn't mean anything. Wait, I want to have satellites, though. Uh, how long to have satellites? Ten, Ten days, days for two. Yeah. We can also go to the gray market and sell damaged stuff, which is no good. Like this power source got damaged, so we can sell those. Same with these flight computers. Uh, these are actually good, so we should keep yeah. those. Uh, weapon fragments are good. Illyrium, we should keep. Chrysalids, we should keep. We can do stuff with these eventually. Yeah. Thin men, we can probably sell a couple of these. Alright. Alright, now we have 123 credits. We can actually buy stuff. South Africa, UK, and Australia and Germany are the current watch bots. We've got a satellite over South America, North America, and Europe. Asia is probably not too happy. We already lost Russia, right? Yeah. Yeah, poor Russia. Poor Russia. Okay, let's scan for alien activity. When we have all laser weapons, maybe we could do the alien base assault. Hey, we got heavy lasers! Alright. Mm -hmm. And we can also manufacture a laser cannon. Okay, heavy laser, cool. Laser cannon. Oh, these are for the interceptors. Well, that might not be a bad idea. Yeah. Okay, should we do the skeleton suit next or the Illyrium? Oh, uh, what does Illyrium do? It's a special metal we capture from, um, well, it's a new element. Metallic element that we captured from the ships. Okay. All right, let's research the Illyrium. Kind of curious to see what it'll actually do. Uh, we do have some money now, so we should actually probably build a couple of these lasers that we were working on. Uh, these, actually. Let's manufacture two of them. Okay, we got two of those. We needed another laser rifle, because one guy was running around without one. That's kind of silly. So we'll... Oh, shit. I made an extra one. Oh, well. 
As for the laser sniper rifle, I think we should make one more. Ah, it's a two. Can't hurt. All right, we got plenty of med kits. We need a lot more chrysalid corpses if we want to make chitin plating, which is like a, a supplement for armor. Um, can we make anything else there? We've already got carapace armor, and we're pretty much out of money again. Oh well. Okay, so let's get back to scanning in the main station. Yeah, seven we're seven days out to satellites. Oh yeah, we're coming up on it. The council is requesting your attention. Secure uh -oh. transmission coming in now. Oh boy. Who's quitting? Oh no, it's a target escort. One of the scientists serving in a remote observatory used for tracking and monitoring UFO activity in France has come under attack. We can't allow the aliens to threaten any personnel contributing information to the XCOM project. We'll need you to deploy a squad and ensure a safe return. Yeah, okay. In reward, we get 250 uh, credits. Well, panic reduction in France and two scientists. Yeah, but we need money, so... <laughs> we need all that stuff. Alright, this guy got wounded, so we need to probably replace him. Alright, we got... Let's see. Assault, sniper, heavy, support, assault... Um, you need to get the guns. We need a, probably another support person. Yeah. Do we have another? Uh, Jake Peters is the highest ranking right now. Yeah. Alright, yeah. so let's... Uh, whoop. Stop clearing him. Let's clear him out. You know, we don't want him here. Ugh. Okay, so let's give him equipment. Laser rifle. Carapace armor. Normal pistol. And you get your med kit, because that's your job. <laughs> we need more experience medics. <laughs> yeah. Badly. All right. We have... You gotta fix Arcade. Oh, God, I hate that. Like, seriously, we really need more... Uh, Let's fix it right now. More input. Well, what what are we gonna... I don't remember the suggestion that we had, but we're, we're, we can fix it right now. Get rid of this ridiculous nickname. But I want to use suggestions from your viewers. Do you want what you need? Mr. Answer? Nice was one of them. Okay. All right, he'll be Mr. Nice Guy. Or Mr. Nice. That seems good to me. All right, cool. We got Mr. Nice from Canada. Makes sense. Racism. Um, Mr. Nice, eh? Yeah. Oh, God. All right, got a rocket launcher. We got the nanofiber vest and the carapace armor. That's pretty cool. All right, everyone's got laser weapons now, right? Laser, laser rifle, laser shotgun, laser sniper rifle, rifle... Okay, we've got two supports, two assaults, a sniper, and a heavy. Looks yeah. good, right? Let's go. And this guy, Hernandez, has the arc thrower. Okay. In case we want to capture anybody else. And off we go. Hello, France! Ah. We are in Lille, France. We need to escort the scientist to safety. First, we need to find him. Yeah, they tend to be whiny. I'm sure you'll hear them before you see them. Some of them are not that whiny. Well, that's the council believes Dr. Marizuki's research to be extremely valuable. They're requesting we escort him safely to the evac point. Big Sky will be in position to make the pickup at the other end of the facility. Ah, oh, so we have to go yeah, through the facility and out the other side. Okay. All right. Well, actually, hold on a second. My efforts here have been focused on studying the aliens. Well, we have them already. Yeah. In the hopes of determining exactly where it is they came from. So we just need to get out. Apparently we just walked through the front door and there he was. And now we have to get him outside. Well, that's good to know. All right. Well, let's, uh... I guess the direct group probably makes the most mm -hmm. sense. Okay, do we see any creepy aliens? We sure do. That yep. did not take long. And all we had to do was open the door. Alright, well I suppose we should shoot one. Or not. Yeah, good, good effort. Mr. Nice is just, you know... Too nice for that. Yeah, he's, he's keeping his namesake here. He doesn't want to foul his reputation. Alright, we can come at them from another angle too, see if we can surprise anybody. Um, hmm... She can't run that much farther, so we'll have Nishimura go over here. Aha! She's got an angle on somebody. Alright, we could... Well, he actually can't really get outside very far. They can do a poison 
like spit that affects an area so we can't have our teams bunch up too much or they're going to be in trouble. We'll have Hernandez come through this direction. Bam. Alright, nobody in that room. Alright, this guy will come up to here and get ready to run through the door using the pillar as safety. Make sense? Yeah, sure. Alright, and this person, I suppose he can come over here. Oh wait, that might actually provoke a shot from the alien up there. I think he should go with Hernandez and get ready to run outside with him. Because he's one of the medics, Jacob Peters. And fine, oh, uh, we have Marizuki himself. Uh, just run up against the wall and huddle there. Hide in terror! Hide in terror! Your life is at stake, you madman. Alright, you just chill out. Oh, or, you know, there you go. Alright, let's see what the aliens do. Actually, running closer. They're moving and flank me! Oh, come on, they can't... Wow! Four damage and it shattered the wall. Look out, Nishimura, you're getting sniped! Apparently. You've got sniper competition. Only one damage on our uh, big tough guy, Mr. Nice. So, who can he shoot at now? He could turn around and shoot out that way, but I don't think that's really the thing he should do. In fact, I kind of have a sneaking suspicion he can just kind of run over here, plop down right next to this guy, and shoot him in the face! Hmm. Bye! <laughs> that animation was so off. Oh yeah. But it was like... Oh crap! And I forgot that they it make the ejective gas, so he's poisoned now. Mm. We have to get him to a doctor. Or a doctor to him. Or a doctor to him, yes. Darn. Alright, well we'll have Nishimura on Overwatch out here. Just in case. Hernandez, meanwhile... Oh, I have an idea. We'll have him run and gun. Run for the cover inside this truck. Get behind this guy and then pop him while he's on the roof. Hmm. Hi! Nice. Mm -hmm. Alright, meanwhile, Badass can go run out in the middle of the open and be absolutely fine, because that's kind of how his life works. Yeah. Uh-oh, but now he's flanked. Maybe he won't be so fine. You don't say. Alright, this medic... Um, I guess you should cover Hernandez's flank in case there are bad guys up on top of the roof Wait, there. where's the other medic? The other From medic is... Here. Oh, well that's interesting. Um, it's not worth using a med kit because they currently heal four on him until the poison has actually taken more of an effect. Yeah. So we're just going to have him... You should keep him nearby, though. Yeah. I actually think that he could take into this cover here and maybe... Well, you actually... No. Because there's another. There's two of them. He's going to throw a smoke grenade right at his feet. That way, both him and Badass will have cover. Mm -hmm. So maybe they can survive the next exchange of bullets. And this guy can go huddle in the corner. And of course he gets hit in the smoke. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it was also critical for three, so... <laughs> Twice. Yeah. That did not help nearly as much as I thought it would. Alright, Mr. Nice is gonna have to do something about these not-so-nice aliens. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh -oh. crap. They are just all over the place here. He's exposed, but it's already too late. He doesn't have a good shot at either one of these guys. I think it might be better for him to pull back and to get into cover. Yeah. Alright, as for these fellas... Well, I don't know about you, but I think Badass is going to be a little upset after that exchange. So, I'm going to have Axel here... Give Badass a good spray. Now that he's feeling better about himself. Alright, if he's gonna be called Axel, it has to be Axel Rose. Oh, please, no. No? No, not that. Yes. 
Why? Uh, because I love Axolos. Oh, 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 why? All right, so we're going to have him run over here into cover, peek around the corner, and maybe shoot this guy in the face, if possible. I <laughs> or, or he's doing this. Even though he's right there. Yeah. Apparently it's a bit too of a scatter shot. All right, let's have our other medic run up here, see if he can shoot somebody on the roof. No, he cannot. But again, he needs to keep going to get to the roof. Yes, he does. I find myself wondering how far these creatures have traveled to undertake this invasion. The resources of mold are staggering. I'm sure they are. That's why you're going to put your head down and stop talking. <laughs> Thank you for educating us while we try to shoot them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we really need this explanation here, Doctor. Oh yeah, cutscene! Yep, yeah, she just needed lasers! That's all she needed. Now she never misses. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay with that. Yeah, it, it's alright. Hmm getting quiet around here. I mean, there are these two munchkins over here, but we can do something about that. He's on overwatch, and he's falling back. They're both going on overwatch. Oh, if only Badass had a grenade. God, that would be paradise. He doesn't have a grenade? No, he doesn't. No. You can give him one, but all he has is his shotgun, so it just doesn't make much sense. Alright, he's got a better shot at him without exposing himself, so... Give it a try. Nope. Mm -hmm. Target's still up. Yes, thank you, Anonymous. Mm-hmm. We sure did. All right, let's have him actually go inside the third floor. Maybe up to a window here. Knock, knock. See who he can spot. Open the door. All right, and put him on Overwatch. Good to have somebody watch on the roof. You are not coming out there until those aliens are dead. Meanwhile, you... You're going to run over here. Meaning those two guys are going to be in trouble next turn if they don't get out of there. As for him, this medic... Yeah, we're going to have him run over here. Eh, he'll be fine, I'm sure. Hmm. Yeah, right over his head. Just stay low and keep moving. Or, okay, dodge another one. Or take it in the face. Yeah. Yeah, that was right in the face. Mm -hmm. For only three damage, though. Gotcha. Not as bad as you know, we thought. And he can fire back. You can do it. All <laughs> right. Now we're making progress. As for Nishimura, um, hmm. I stay right where you are. Just go on Overwatch. Hernandez, he should move forward and try to make sure the way out of here is safe. And of course it's not. Mm -hmm. Alright, he does not have a shot, but that's okay. We'll put him on overwatch. Oh, look at this little munchkin. What's he gonna do? Oh, he's taking a very far shot at a guy in full cover, and of course he hits him! That is impressive. Really. Yeah. That's that's quite... That's very impressive. You know what? I, I don't really want... No, fine. I'm, I'll shoot. I, I want to shoot my rocket, but you know what? It's okay. <laughs> we could just use <laughs> the lasers. It would have been a bit of an overkill. It would have. You know, I imagine, though, Mr. Nice is getting a little bit frustrated at that point. You know? Yeah. Okay. All right, Axel. All right, we're going to have you run up here. Whoa! Somebody inside the house! Amen. Keep moving! No regard for windows! Nishimura does not have a shot. But does this guy. He does, and he can run and gun to make sure it works. Now, we don't want to get too close. So how about we put him... Uh, where could we put him? That's decent. That's not really good cover. Oh, hell, let's put him over here. So long, suckers! Okay, is this close enough? It should be. There we go. Alright, badass, uh, go run up here. 
See if there's anybody in there? There doesn't seem to be. That's good. Meanwhile, our rooftop friend, you can come out here and go on Overwatch to see if anyone pops up their ugly head. Now I think he has a chance to run. So go, 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 Marizuki. Ishimura, keep watching. Stay alert, strike one. You have hostile forces come to your position. Oh, that's not good. Mm -mm. I don't know where they are, though. Oh, they're popping up behind us. And going on Overwatch. Aha, Nishimura isn't going to put up with that. Hmm. Slow motion. Hmm. 15 damage. Ouch. Yeah. That, that lasers work. Yeah, they, they do. They, wow, they work really well. Mm -hmm. All right, Mr. Nice, meanwhile, is going to try to rejoin the others. Specifically our medic up here, because he's kind of hurt. And I think the poison is still affecting him, but I'm not sure. Actually, it doesn't seem to be, but either way, he can get a little batch of healing, though. <laughs> You'll be okay. Let me just spray you with this stuff. Oh, chlorosol. Uh, Alright, well, we'll have him run up to this cover, and it should be one more turn, and we'll be able to get out of here. Ah, Nishimura, you keep doing exactly what you were doing. Hernandez, uh, uh, you run up here and keep a lookout for anybody coming in. Meanwhile, badass, you're going to be a badass and run on top of this truck hmm. and look official. Yeah. There you go. Anybody hanging out? Nope, doesn't look like it. If you're going to do something badass, you should look good doing it. Exactly. Are likely closing on your location. Yeah, but where? Yeah, just... Like right next to him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Reaction shot. Hello. Ah, hmm. oh, he just missed him. Mm. Well, you know what? That guy's in the worst possible position right now because he is right in front of Badass. And there's any if there's one thing that Badass doesn't like, yep. there are aliens getting in his face. Yeah, aliens in general. Yep. Okay, well, I think the doctor can actually make it out of here. Go, doctor, go! Woo! Thank you for coming to my aid. I only hope my data is beneficial to the cause. Oh, we hope so too. Mm -hmm. Mission success. Things have been looking up lately. Yeah, don't jinx it. Oh, jinx what? Yeah. Superstitious nonsense. We're getting lucky. Corporal Hernandez and Captain Gal. Yeah, badass is now Major Badass. Woo! And Hernandez has earned the nickname Cobra. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Let's see, he gets lightning reflexes or close and personal. Close and personal gives him a bonus critical chance against targets he's close to. Lightning reflexes forces the first reaction shot against this unit to miss. Of course, lightning reflexes. And Major Badass, he automatically gets extra conditioning. Confers bonus health based on which type of armor is equipped. Mm. Heavier armor increases the bonus. Cool. So we need to give him heavier armor. And he'll be even more badass than before. Mm. We get some Thin Man corpses and some weapon fragments. Money, panic reduction, and scientists. Oh, money. Excellent. We should get the um, lasers for the interceptors. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. Okay. Um, where? Oh, they would be interceptors, over. Interceptors, yeah. Laser cannon. It looks like this is better than the stuff that we had before. Hey, let's build some more defense matrixes. Those are useful. We'll build, I don't know. Get the laser cannon. Laser cannon, right. Alright, how many should we make? At least two. Oh, we don't have enough alloys. Oh, okay, so make one for now. Okay. Shame we could have. We didn't have more. I thought we had more alloys than that. That's we should make one of those at least. A phoenix least. cannon? Just so the other one has something better. Because they're going to... There are two other them. ones. Uh -huh. Alright, so we'll get these. Yeah. And uh, we can actually build another satellite or Do two. Do it! How many? I don't know. Oh, we're not going to have enough uplink capacity. 
So, before we build more satellites, we need to build facilities in order to use them. Alright, so we need to get another uplink. Yeah, and it looks like we have to start expanding downward, so... Okay. Let's build a satellite uplink. Why can't we build it? Not enough powder oh. build generator. Alright, well, can we build a generator here, then? That'll network with the adjacent generator. Yeah, okay. Yes, we can. Uh, yeah, do it. And we also have workshops going in this direction. We should probably also start excavating. That would probably be helpful. Yeah. Workshops, adjacent, those are good. Oh, wait, we don't really have the ability for that. We should build a foundry somewhere. How about right here by the alien containment? Okay. All right. Go! All right, yeah. so now we're expanding our power capacity so we can use more satellites. Excellent. Let's scan until we actually have the satellites so we can deploy them. It should go by pretty quickly. Five days does not take very long. Excellent. All right. All right, let's deploy some satellites, okay. earn some credits, and relieve some panic. What should we focus on? Oh, uh, well, what do you get for each one? All right, well, let's take a launch satellite. Here we go. Mm -hmm. That will tell us. South Africa, we get 140 credits a month and another engineer per month. Okay. UK, uh, we already have one there. Mm -hmm. For another one, we get 160 a month mm -hmm. and three mm -hmm. scientists. Mm -hmm. For Germany, we get 50 a month and three scientists. Okay, so the For Australia, time. we get two engineers per month and 60 more per month. Wait, what was South Africa again? South Africa was 140 per month and another and an engineer. Yeah, but we eventually get scientists and engineers, so I think that might be... Better to invest in South Africa? Yeah, for oh. now. Because we have two satellites, so do one there and then we'll, another one in the UK. Okay, we'll have satellite coverage over a third of the countries in Africa. Let's do it. We have no interceptors in range of, in Africa, so we need to build more. All right. We have another satellite. And we do. Yes, we have one more. So maybe we should do the UK because that gives us more money too. Australia has no coverage though, but it doesn't give us very much money. Yeah. So UK will get us the most money. Yeah. So I guess we'll do the UK. All right, now we need to build more facilities to have our satellites working properly. We need to make more interceptors too. Yeah. We have no money right now. Unless we can send one. Oh, we actually need just to build more interceptors. Yeah. I wonder how much they cost. Uh, monthly cost 20, initial cost 40. All right, so we basically need to sell some stuff. Badly. Let's go to the gray market. See what we can get rid of. No, we need those. We need those. And we're researching this. Nothing is worth enough money to actually sell it. So we just want to get rid of a lot of thin men. No. I'll just sell them all. All right, now we can order at least one. Uh, floater, we'll hold on to those, I guess. Yeah. All right, so now we I think we can order one interceptor. And we need it for... We have North America, South America. We don't have one in Europe, but no. we have satellites, and we don't have one in Africa. Yeah. So we need to order one for Africa. And we need to order one for Europe. Okay, excellent. We should also order one for Asia, but wait, we don't have any coverage there, so it won't yeah. matter. All right, we also need to assign weapons that we yeah. made. Are they finished being made? Uh, yeah, they're made instantly. Let's give him the laser cannon. The one in uh, South yeah. America. And the one in North America will give him the Phoenix cannon. And these two are still on order. We should make one... Oh, we don't have any money left. Yeah. Um, how much more time before the new uh, accounts report? 11 days. We're actually about to get a couple more things done. Alright, we got a power generator. That's good. So we can make more satellite uplink. Oh crap, we just got a UFO contact. Over France. 
We gotta leave it alone, though, because we have no interceptors in range. Yeah, not yet. Not for another day. Oh, three days, actually. Oh, okay. So we're just gonna have to leave it be. We can assign new research. What did we find out about Illyrium? Manufacturing this element is beyond our capabilities. We only be able to use it whatever we recover from alien craft and alien bases. Alright. Uh, hyper releases an astonishing amount of energy. Very powerful artificial material. We don't have enough alloys now to research either the Titan armor or the skeleton suit. Alright, so we'll find out. We can start working on plasma weapons or the new fighter craft. New fighter craft. You think that should be a priority? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. It'll take half a month, but... No, it's okay. We don't have any money left, and we don't really have anything to sell. So, it looks like we should find out... See, this is a bit of a problem, because we mm -hmm. we're going to need a better weapon in order to chase that UFO that's over France. Hopefully it doesn't disappear too quickly. So, I think maybe we should... Uh, 614 a month, that's pretty good. Okay. We should sell uh, just a couple of crap, stuff we don't need. Uh, maybe a few weapon fragments, one of the flight computers. Do it. Okay. Wait, why are we doing this? We're doing this because we've got two more ships uh, on order, but we only have enough to fit one more gun. So we need okay. to make another upgraded gun for the ships. And that means, uh, apparently a Phoenix Cannon, because we don't yeah. have enough alloys for another laser cannon. So hopefully that will be sufficient. Alright, and let's... Why do we want to do the alien basis one? Soon, I hope. Alright, it looks like... Yeah, our order has arrived. Okay. Alright, hold on. We're just going to pause it for the time being. The one that's going to be over the UK will be there in two days. Oof, do you think it'll still be there? Um, well, no. We had... They said that we found it. It said scramble. We need, just need to equip the new weapon, and then we can go after it. Okay. Alright, so if we and just have to equip the new weapon... Yeah. Alright. See, it says it's ready. Okay. It'll take a day to re-equip. Okay. Let's hope that's uh, soon enough that we can actually make the difference. Yeah. Alright, so now we've got a fighter in each section. Um, do we, can we do anything in the OCS? Uh, not right now. Okay, let's scan for one day. Oh wow, I've got abductions too! Oh, and it rains and pours. Okay, we can go to South Africa, Toronto, Canada, or the UK. Which one has the highest panic? South Africa or the UK? Yeah. Oh, but we get a support captain if we go yeah. to Canada. Alright, this just gives us 200 for scientists. Neither, none of the panic ratings are high enough that it's a danger, though. Yeah. So, I think it might be worthwhile to go to Canada and try to get that captain. Because a support captain would be so invaluable right now. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh, suit everybody up real quick. Badass with this stuff. He's got a yeah, scope, nano fiber mm -hmm. vest. We got a support with a med kit. Support with a med kit. We've got him with the arc thrower. Yeah, we're actually all set to go before we even have to do anything. Ah, UFO 5 is still in contact, so maybe right after this mission we can intercept that. Alright. Gosh, this squad is overworked. I think, though, that once we arrive on site, we're probably going to have to save it and call this a session. Probably going to be a little bit longer than our normal session, but hey, what can we say? This is a fun game, and we enjoy playing it. Yeah, we do. I well, hope you enjoy it as much as we are. Ben? All right. Looks like we're going to be... Dancing around in the cemetery soon enough. Yeah, creepy. Oh well. Don't worry, there won't be any zombies. Why do you do these things to me? Oh, uh, ha, ha. Alright, well this is Lucky and Goofy and Mr. Nice saying goodbye for now, everybody. Bye, see you next time. Later!